the dodge chance might not help him out if he gets caught in the shackle as well as a lucky bounce from a cask. Yeah, now that the Shadow Shaman is rotated back over, he's definitely in some danger. The cask will go out, only gonna bounce once. Can only bounce twice anyways at rank one, and the body blocks here from FRL might gonna throw out. I mean, it's, this guy's back up, he's two and four now. Yeah. Yeah, he, he this chrono can't good. carry this game in the mid game right now. Up against oh. the laser. Oh. Some hero bounces there off that cast. The death ward is dropped. SP though, almost gonna get blown up by us. Yeah, he will go down. The double edge finally comes out, and that's the bulk of the damage. But again, onto the Brulings, and of course, uh, who are they gonna get in the back there? TC, Narok trying to bring down TC. This is Eye of the Storm rank one, even though it's a level 12 Razor, and it looks like it's gonna be enough. He gets cycloned up, but that Eye of the Storm is still doing a lot of damage over onto Osh. And it will bring him down, but this fight's so far really good for Nyx. Now, Way 2 is going to come in. It's going to be I Annihilate with a double kill. 3 for 3 trade right now. And we've got Nature's Prophet. He will stay alive. I'm just going to say that. I could have sworn he was level 11 when I looked at yeah, him pretty much. Ago. Oh, like, why? Mike trying to make the plays, trying to go for that steal. That commitment, at least he committed. He will go down, though, for his efforts. Ush also going to be dropped down in a beautiful death ward. Way too gets off a nice epi once again. Looking to take down the supports. Will get one, but now Nature's Prophet's still alive up here with that blade mail. Looking to walk through the macro, but... Well, Shakira's already dead, and now TC. I Annihilate may be staying a little too far in, but no, he will bring down the Viper. It's a triple kill for the Nature's Prophet. I'm sitting at two or three hundred apiece, so that's going to prompt me to check, check out the graphs here. And boom, it's a steep increase, starting at about 17 minutes. But before that, we're going to see another Nyx Assassin. Oh, maybe not. He gets an Ice Path off, looking to drop a Macro and a Liquid Fire, but he can't. Chrono will go out, Death Ward and the Cask bouncing around, now TC going to be the focus here, he will survive, Brewmaster throwing up the Void, which is going to be nice, but I Nihilate comes in, there's just too much to deal with, the Nyx Assassins can't handle it all, they're doing what they can, the Primal Split is just not enough teamfight control, and TC, 23 minutes in, is just going to call out the GG. But from the double damage run, just one teamfight too much, yeah, I don't <laughs> think go. they...